Hello, this is Dr. Tyler Hamill, chiropractor and nutritionist in Kingwood. Today we're going to do a short video on autoimmune conditions. So autoimmune conditions, what are we talking about? For thyroid, we have Hashimoto's disease, we have lupus, we have rheumatoid arthritis that affects the joints, we have celiac disease, which affects uh, the gut and digestion. All these conditions, basically, your immune system is attacking its own body. So for Hashimoto's disease, we have the immune system attacking your own thyroid gland. For lupus, we have your immune system attacking the spleen. Rheumatoid arthritis, your immune system is attacking the joints. That's why people come in and they're achy everywhere, elbows, knees, hips. Celiac disease, basically the immune system is attacking the gut lining, the intestines, so you're not able to break down and digest foods properly. So autoimmune conditions, what does traditional medicine offer? Usually a pill of some kind to help make you feel better or maybe decrease inflammation, right? With autoimmune conditions, there's a lot of inflammation, which causes a lot of discomfort and a lot of pain. What the pill will do for you is maybe make you feel a little bit better, but it's not really getting to the underlying cause of the problem. You're not taking anything or taking a medicine that's going to help boost the immune system or maybe detox the body of chemicals and metals, things like that that can make a big difference with autoimmunity. Also, they never really look at the diet. Diet or food sensitivities have a big part in autoimmune conditions. If the immune system is hyped up in a way, out of sync and attacking your body, you need to calm that down any way you can. So what we offer here, we have holistic medicine, it's functional medicine, we offer a couple different things to help with autoimmune conditions. The first, number one thing is diet. We look to remove all the wheat, gluten, soy, dairy from the diet. These are food sensitivities which cause extra inflammation which will always make autoimmune conditions worse. The second thing we do is we like to detox the body from chemicals and metals. We are exposed to these things every single day and it makes sense if we have these um, metals and, and chemicals and things like that, and toxins build up in the body, usually stored sometimes in organs or stored in fat, it's going to make us feel uh, pretty uncomfortable or pretty crappy and it's going to cause problems with autoimmune conditions or, or exacerbate it or cause flare-ups. And this is why we see autoimmune conditions. Patients sometimes they're doing okay and then in another two days they can hardly get out of bed. They're achy, uh, they're miserable, they're chronically fatigued. So what I'm talking about here is autoimmune conditions. If you've been suffering from an autoimmune condition and you're just not getting any help, which we see this quite often, taking medicine for 10, 15, 20 years and you're still not getting any better, uh, functional medicine may be the route for you. If you like, you can contact us at info at wellness24.org. You can get some more information on what you can do, what healthy things you can do to the body to support the body to help with autoimmune conditions. We do not fix, heal, or repair autoimmune conditions. Your body, if given the right things, can do that on its own. Again, thank you for watching this video. My name is Dr. Tyler Hamill. I'm a chiropractor and nutritionist in Kingwood, and I look forward to meeting you. Thank you.